What's going on Salt Strong Nation? I've got a great tip for you guys on catching big trout in the spring in a very overlooked spot. Most of us know sea trout like to hang around seagrass and the big flats, but an area that I see a lot of people pass up are big docks and rock walls. Trout are really serious ambush predators and structures like pier pilings or the big rocks that they can sit behind when the current's passing through them is going to allow them to have a really good ambush spot. So I would recommend that you look for those areas where you've got really heavy tidal movements that move move through piers, maybe around a point, or if you've got a rock wall on a point, know those trout are gonna stage down current of that area as that bait passes by and jump out, ambush it, and get right back behind that structure. They're not a predator that likes to sit in current, but they like to be near it because it brings food to them. And a lot of times what I'll do to work these types of structures, like the docks that you're seeing behind me or the rock wall even further behind, is use this power prawn right here. This is a really great option to work really close to structure because the retrieve allows you to stay in the strike zone really long instead of rolling a paddle tail really quickly through there. So if you've got a dock that you're throwing on, a little twitch twitch pause, right down current. Uh, a lot of times I'll actually throw up current of the dock, allow the current to carry it as I twitch it, and I'm going to get a lot of really great bites as it starts to pass, usually past that last pier piling or that last rock in a rock wall. That's normally where those big trout are going to stage, and you'll find a lot of fish there ready and willing to eat, just like in the video you guys are about to see here. Yeah. Did you throw up near the dock pilings at all? I'm gonna throw one right up under it. Oh, uh, that's how I've been catching uh, reds on the uh, Oh, well, not quite under it, but close enough. Tell you what, I will screw this. Maybe, maybe I'll give that another shot. That's fish. Good trout. Oh man, I'm trying to spot lug us. There we go. Yeah, it's 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 throwing its head real hard. Should be able to get it. It's a it's a big trout. I saw him come out of the water. Oh look at that thing. Oh my gosh! Oh, dude. Oh, my gosh. Oh, bat, right next to that dock, just like we said. So that was on that power prawn, and it had a uh, owner twist lock sitting in the, the back of its gill plate, but that thing is a grizzled monster. This fish has been out here for a while. So I know a lot of folks love to fish those big grass flats for those nice big gator trout, but know that there's a lot of very big quality fish that are sitting probably on the same structures you're launching your boat off of. Look for those nice piers that are on points, have good current flow around them. Also those rock walls, great places to look for trout in the spring. And definitely be sure to use a lure that allows you to stay in the strike zone. Could be a suspending twitch bait like the Paul Brown Fat Boy, Soft Dyne XL, the Mirror Lure, um, or these power prawns if you're trying to feel out different depths. Uh, I like to use these on a mag shrooms jig head just because a lot of times there is a lot of structure around the areas I'm fishing. I've also used the weedless hoss hooks uh, and had pretty good success around the rock walls with that. But those are really my, my general presentations for trout when I'm fishing big structures. Something that allows me to stay close to that structure and almost suspend in that area or bounce in that one small zone because if you roll a paddle tail through there really quickly, very good chance you're going to miss a lot of fish with a very fast presentation when they're just sitting there waiting to jump out and grab something. So making it easy on them with a power prawn or a suspending twitch bait is really my go-to. So I hope this tip was helpful for you guys. If you want to see more awesome fishing information, definitely check us out at saltstrong.com or pick up some of these power prawns. These are a fantastic lure. If you want to get onto big fish, we've been catching big reds, big trout, big snook. All the predators are after this bait right now. So I highly recommend you grab one of these. So thank you again so much for watching and I'll see you guys on the next video. And if you're new to Salt Strong, just know that we're the number one online fishing club in America because we actually guarantee we're gonna help you catch more fish, save money on tackle, and help you make friends fast, or it's free. Thanks again for watching, and we're hoping to see you in the Insider Club family soon.